I'm seeing flash floods in Belgium and England and Germany. The whole of Europe is under record-breaking rain. Confirmed. There's also record-breaking heat on the western continent. In Canada, it's well off the charts. The roads are turning into rivers while the wildfires are burning in Siberia and America. And there's landslides in India. They've lost a bridge. I tell you what I don't understand. Oh yeah, they can all see it. Their media is reporting on it. Even the little kids know, but it's like they don't care. They don't see the emergency. They only think in human lifespans. Yes, but you'd think at least one of them, surely at least one of them would notice and, and try to escape. Yeah, though, wait, look, there is one. It's one of the owner class, is in a massive rocket. It's, it's shaped like an huge dong. Oh yes, I see him. Is he trying to escape? Perhaps even if capitalism does doom the civilization, it can somehow at least spread from this one planet, survive a Fermi extinction to start anew on some new world. If one can escape, then the species could spread. Well, we'd have to put a stop to that, obviously. Oh yeah, of course. We can't let this contagion escape the planet. Oh. He's out of fuel. What? He's an hundred miles up, but that's all. He's got no warp engine, no vacuum burners, nothing. Just more burned carbon in the atmosphere, and not a planet and nowhere else to go but down. I suppose that's the problem. There is no point in trying to escape. Even if they had the technology, and even if there was somewhere to go, it'd be impossible to ship humans off the Earth faster than they're being born. And yet they still don't stop. The weather gets more violent, they're soaked or on fire, and they still don't stop. It's like they can't even think about it. Yes, it's too awful to discuss. So their media gossips about billionaire spacemen instead of about energy use and power generation and the limits of a closed economic system. So that's it then. A mental block in their media dooms their whole world. It seems so. The Fermi paradox is resolved. They can't save their world because they're too busy arguing about billionaire spacemen on Twitter or watching distracting cartoons on YouTube. <laughs>